Hi everyone, I'm Mike, and today we're in Winter Garden, Florida, which is just to the west of Orlando. And today I'm gonna to show you this home behind me. Now this is a new construction home, so it's a little bit different, but it is five bedrooms, five full baths, with 4,076 square feet. Now the inside of this home is absolutely beautiful. They have a ton of upgrades. So if you want it, as we see it here, it's gonna be a little bit over a million dollars to build it with the upgrades that we see in this specific home. So come ahead and follow me, come this direction here, and I'm gonna show you a little bit about this home. So this home is called the Serenity by MI Homes. Um, and it is a very good builder. It's actually the same builder that my mom purchased um, their, her home with. So as I come up here, we do have a front patio area that's covered. We have some nice brickwork as you see here, but the really nice part about this home is what's on the inside. So come on and follow me inside and see this home. All right, so welcome home to this beautiful home. Um, as I come in here, let's talk a little bit about this front entryway. Obviously, we have a wide entryway, and then the door I just came in is a nice door with a glass insert, as you see. But let me go ahead and start showing you some of the absolutely amazing features of this home. The first thing I want to do is I want to look up, because up we have three chandeliers with woodworking designs all around, each th all three of them, that really makes this a very, very amazing entrance. So, and then if I look down, we have engineered hardwood floors. And then we also have this beautiful mirror that's also built into the wall here. So the staircase is right here to my right going upstairs. But before we do that, let's go ahead and start here and go left. And if I go left this direction here, we go into bedroom number two. So bedroom number two is a carpeted bedroom. Um, and it does have this really nice chandelier here as well. And that's what I really like about this home. They have some really cool designs. One, one cool design is the wall. Look at the wall, how the wall is designed with the mirrors in there and also the protruding uh, wall parts that really make it sort of like a Tetris game back there. It's pretty neat. And then this actually has its own bathroom, which is here. So we have a bathroom suite. And the nice thing about this bathroom is that it does have some really nice color cabinets, countertops, and we also have the ceramic tile floor. And then behind me, look at this beautiful tile work here in the actual bath shower area where we have this beautiful color and also these very attractive inserts in the actual tile work that goes all the way up to the ceiling. So let's go ahead and go back and continue because we haven't seen anything yet. This home's got some really cool features. So we come this direction here and we have our dining room here to my right, to your left. And as you see, we have enough for an eight, eight person dining room set. And then look at that feature wall back here with the actual built-ins, the woodworking, and also the mirrors. So this is gets you a really good idea. Whether you're looking to purchase a home today or in a year from now, or already love your home and maybe want to do some upgrades to it, these videos give you some really good ideas of what they've done in these model homes with the interior design to actually make them extremely attractive. So come ahead and follow me this direction here. And we'll go to the heart of the home, the actual family room, kitchen room, kitchen and breakfast nook area. So here is the family room area. And what I want to talk about here is also the feature wall with the woodworking, that actual wallpaper with a little sparkles in it right behind the TV there. We have a shelf over above the TV. Um, and then on the ceiling, obviously we have this woodworking and also the chandelier area uh, where you have this chandelier going and it really puts out a really good um, feel to this room. And of course, we have the engineered hardwood uh, uh, flooring and then this area rug going around. So over here is the kitchen. And the kitchen has this beautiful countertop with a waterfall um, edges where the actual countertop goes and actually goes down to the floor. And then, as you can see, this is a gourmet kitchen. So we have the built-in oven microwave. We have a five burner gas stove top with a actual vent going out. And this one actually has a pot filler. So pot fillers are pretty cool. You can do this and I don't want to turn it just in case actually the water's on, which it probably is. And then you can actually have your pot here and fill it out with water, um, which is a pretty neat feature as well. The backsplash is extremely attractive. It's like a glass area, uh, glass type with, looks like a wood grain, grays and black sort of color on it. All in, it looks like an octagon shape. Maybe a pentagon shape. I have to actually count how many lines there is there. So anyway, um, and then we come over here, we have this sink. This sink is a farmhouse sink, which means it's a little bit below the countertop, plenty of space, this really nice faucet here. We have the dishwasher right here. And of course, all these cabinets 
and the cabinets are all high-end cabinets with the soft clothes. So um, what we can do now is actually look at the pantry, which is right over here. So this is the pantry. And as you can see, you have plenty of space here. They have drink, 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 mine and yours. Lots of cool little de decor in the pantry, but of course you would have all your food supplies in there. So also we have some really nice pendant lighting here over the kitchen counter. And then it goes into the breakfast nook area. This is a five seat table here, round table. Um, a simple light fixture above it. And of course we have a really nice view in the specific house out to the pool area. Also a pretty large yard, especially with new construction and then the lake behind that. So over here is the laundry room. So you follow me here, we can see the laundry room. We do have the sink area and cabinets and then the washer and dryer and all the cabinetry around there as well. And then this is some extra space that would actually be part of the third car garage bay. So coming back this direction here, we do have a pool door bath or pool door, which goes out. And then we also have a bathroom here. Um, this bathroom is a little nice bathroom and it has nice countertops here, uh, cabinets. And then we have this uh, ceramic uh, backsplash here going all the way up to the ceiling. And then also a shower on this side here with the ceramic tile going all the way up to the ceiling as well. So that's this area here. We still have to check out the primary bedroom, which is on the first floor. But if you've not done so already, make sure you like this video and also subscribe to our channel for more videos of homes here in the Florida area. So go ahead and follow me and come this direction here. And we'll go over here to the primary bedroom. So we come through here and the hardwood floors continue to come through and we do have the French doors here. So you have the privacy of the French doors. Welcome to the primary bedroom. Come on in. So here's the primary bedroom. This, this room is absolutely stunning. We have the floors, but we also have this feature wall with this woodworking uh, that goes up. And not only does it go up, it actually connects to the ceiling and goes across the ceiling and crisscrosses on the ceiling, which is a really nice feature. Um, and then of course we have the view here also of the, the pool and also the lake behind us. Uh, we have a nice chandelier here. And of course we have the king size bed and we have plenty of space on either side for these very large end table, uh, which are actually beautifully designed too. I like those. So let's go ahead and go over here into the primary bathroom. So this is the primary bathroom. So let me see and talk about this specific one. My favorite feature on this, I guess, see if you can figure out what my favorite feature is on here before I say it. Um, but it's actually, it's these act this actual wall here with this backsplash going all the way up to the ceiling. I think these are beautiful. This is very similar as far as the woodworking sort of design in there as the, um, as the kitchen, but in the rectangle shapes here. Um, it goes all the way up to the ceiling. I do love that something that maybe I may consider doing at my own personal home. Uh, I'm standing on some nice flooring here. Um, and then also we have the cabinets with the granite countertop. On this side, we have a frameless shower. Um, that is a very nice size shower, plenty of space in there. And then it has the massage feature with all the different um, heads here. And of course the head there. So plenty of space in here as well. Oh, and there's also one above me as well. So just make sure no one hits the switch while I'm in here. So let's go this way here. We have another sink area here. Um, also, we have some really cool light fixtures above that sink area. So let me know what you guys think is the best so far. It's the best thing you've seen so far in this house. Just put it in the comments below what you like the best, the family room, the kitchen, this bathroom, what do you like the best? Um, and then come back here and this is the actual closet. As you can see, it's about the size of a room. Um, and we have plenty of space here. Now they do have this one here, um, being that it is a model home, they have a little design here where they show you how they build their homes with their concrete block and installation in the concrete block. Um, MI is a very good builder. I do recommend MI Homes. Um, you know, there are some builders here that are so-so, but MI is one of the best ones. So let's go ahead and go back. And what we can do now is go upstairs and show you the upstairs of this home. And then after that, we'll take you outside and show you everything outside. So I'll meet you 
on the top of the stairs. All right, so here we are on the second floor of this home. Now this home's pretty cool because it actually has like a sort of a third floor up here as well, but we'll talk about that later. First of all, we're gonna go this direction here and go into bedroom number three. So this is the bedroom number three. This one is the one that's all about aviation. They got the F-16 up on the wall. They got some pretty cool uh, designs with the woodworking and then the blues and the grays. And then if I look up on the ceiling, they have this really neat design. Uh, it looks like a steel riveted design, which is pretty cool as well. We do have a full closet over here and they have a picture of a propeller in the closet. I don't know what a picture is doing in the closet, but this is a model home. So that's what they do to make these things pretty cool. So what we're gonna do is go ahead and go backwards here and taking you and show you the full bathroom, which is right here. So this direction here gets you a full size bathroom. It does have the dual sinks. This one has some pretty attractive um, uh, countertops here as well. It's a really nice design. Uh, we have the cabinets. We also have the gray ceramic here. And then behind me is the tub shower area. And they have like a dark gray, light gray sort of ceramic tile going all the way up to the ceiling here as well. So let's go ahead and look at bedroom number four, which is over this direction here. So come and follow me this way. And this will be bedroom number four. This is all about lacrosse. So it's a big sports thing theme going on here. And one of the neat things about here are these bookshelves. What do you guys think about these bookshelves? They're pretty cool. Goes around the corner and uh, it's a pretty neat little design there. And then of course the lacrosse player there that's sort of like disintegrating as they run. And then actual, looks like maybe a patent. Yeah, it's a patent for lacrosse stick, which was patented in May 23rd, 1950, just in case any of you wanted to know that. So we do have a closet right here. And then we have this other cool design here with the artificial grass uh, going all the way up with some miniature lacrosse sticks as well. So let's go over here to my favorite bedroom that's up on this level, which is the bedroom in the back here. It is the biggest bedroom. It also has the best view, which is why I like it. Um, but it also has some pretty cool features here that some people may like. It has the little wall there with the pinks and the turquoises and the blues live your dream and then has this big selfie mirror right here so if you ever wanted to have a selfie you could take your selfie mirror right there so and then the cool thing about this is it has its own bathroom which is back here so we go around here and go around this corner here and we do have a full bathroom area so this bathroom here does have some basic ceramic tile and also a basic shower tub they didn't do that many upgrades in this specific bathroom but of course when you build your own you can do whatever you want in any of these pick whatever colors you want um, and then we have the closet which is right here so we have a walk-in closet here so that is the this floor um, but there is still one more there's a bonus floor one more step up so we're gonna go back over here and then go up to the loft area I love this this may be some of your some of the viewers favorite part here which is this loft section up here so here is this very spacious loft as you see we have some built-ins in there with some like a beverage refrigerator and then check out the shelving area up here with the turquoises blacks and the little shelf that pulls out for putting all your uh, different drinking supplies and then also we even have little built-in shelves throughout here this one here says cheers and this one says drink so some interesting little things here and then we do have another feature wall over here with all these different like blues and yellowish colors coming up here so that's pretty cool fake tv um, but you put your real tv here and then enjoy this really nice space and of course we have this as well so open this up and you go out to your own personal balcony pretty spacious area here looking over the pool the pool's down there should we go check out the pool as well yeah let's go ahead and check out the pool so i'll go ahead and meet you downstairs all right so here we are in the backyard and i do love the actual features here on this specific home as you can see me behind me we do have an infinity edge pool where the water comes over and then falls into this little extra space here and then gets sucked back up into the pool into those fountains but we do have a tanning shelf back there and of course we have the patio and then behind me you see the balcony that we were just at but another thing about this these these properties are actually pretty decent sized properties especially for the new builds um, so we have plenty of grass space here and then of course behind me here or behind you is also even more behind this fence is another huge yard going all the way down to the lake and of course you have that lake view so they only have a couple lots left of this specific uh, in this specific community but if this is something that you're looking at looking for 
make sure you let us know because we can definitely get you a realtor or help you personally find you a home here in this area. So I want to thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed this and make sure you do subscribe to our channel and follow us and talk to you all later. Have a great day.